good, everybody? It is Sully, and it is time for another Reef Runner build update for Twin Tails Yachts as we get ever closer to the Newport Boat Show. The to-do list is here. We've been checking things off that list. I haven't updated it today, but man, we got a lot of that stuff all done or damn near done here. Let's take a look behind me. The Merc Verado V10s are hung. We've got those all set up. We've got our Luma Shore underwater lighting on. We've gone ahead and we've even got this badge properly. This is the Reef Runner Tournament Edition, guys. This thing is set up to kill fish. So let's hop on board and let's see what the guys have been up to. All right, guys, so as we hop on, we were talking about the Mercury's there, getting that all done. You can see here, we have all of our rigging taken care of here. We've got our steering lines, our rig tube, our tie bar going across over to that motor right there. We're getting this all dialed in. We've obviously have to get that all measured up, make sure we are on center for that, getting that all nice, nice right there. And then talking about the Merc rigging, Shannon has been making a home down here. Now we've talked about down there in that space a couple of times. Now let's go ahead down there. I think I think it's all buttoned up right now. I think we've got some wiring ties and a couple little neat and up, tidying up kind of things. But let's go down and let's take a look at what's good in here. So as we come down, the first thing you're gonna see right there, guys, we have the first of our two Merc fuel filters, very easy to access from the hatch. And we pan around, we've got our two Merc black boxes right there. We've got our LumaShore underwater light controller. And we also have our light controller for our live well. Then we have our power steering pump. And we come back to another fuel filter right there. And obviously we still need to do a little housekeeping in the build, but we do have our GSD28 installed right there and all wired up. Again, keeping everything serviceable and easy to get at. So as we make our way out of there, you're going to see we have the combings and bolsters installed on here. We had Donna from Reef Runner come up and join us, give us a hand getting this boat ready for the home stretch here for the boat show. And that entailed getting all of the bolsters and seat cushions on. So her and Adrian were actually hard at work getting these all installed here. You can see we still have the front seat ones that mount right there with armrests still to be installed. But you can see back here, we do have our helm seat installed. Right next to our helm seat is the other to-do list. It's quite long, but the guys are making really great headway on that. And then if we take a look down here in where John's basically been living for the last couple of days, week almost, all the wiring down here. And you'll see we have the Rockford Fosgates, those little blue lights are on. That means those bad Larrys are online and working. So we've got that. We're starting to get the stereo dialed in. You can see we've got our engine batteries all wired up. Everything's all good to go right there. Our LumaShore and everything is right there, ready to go for wiring. We still have to do all of our switch wiring, so we're gonna have network and switching. I think that's probably gonna be the bulk of the day tomorrow. And then one of the nice things we do here, as you can see right there, we've got an a fuse, and then there's a package right there with that. So with that fuse right there, that's a spare. So now, just say for some reason, blow a fuse. That's not something you're normally gonna carry. So we go ahead and make sure you have a spare one of those on hand so that you can keep the party going. So we've got that. And then guys, we have the Rockford Fosgate head unit right here. We're gonna have a whole lot more on this stereo system and all that good jazz. But listening to this, whether it's on your tablet, your phone, AirPods, or maybe, maybe you're watching this on your TV, doesn't do the audio for this system justice. So if you're coming to the Newport show, stop on in and ask for a demo of the Rockford Fosgate stereo. Or just walk around the show, I'm sure you're going to hear it. This thing absolutely rips with all of the speakers that we've installed on this boat. And again, as a reminder, we have 12 
of the eight inch speakers and two 10 inch subs. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn this thing up here and sign out, but trust me guys, this thing rips and uh, we'll see you real soon with another update. And until then guys, peace.